Hello everyone, it's Steve with Aptera Owners Club. Just today, Aptera Motors on their Facebook page and Twitter and their other social media platforms, I think Instagram as well, they released this new picture with this cheeky little comment that says, this isn't gamma anymore, is it? Dot, 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 question mark. Um, so clearly this is the first official look at Delta. And uh, there's a couple of things that we can tell from this. So let's let's look at it together. Um, so I, I downloaded the picture so we could look at it on a, a kind of bigger. And so the, here's the picture. So clearly you see the Tesla plug here. And, um, and the other thing that you'll notice, which is probably the most important thing is this rear deck, if you look carefully here, there's solar panels here. And the rear deck looks like it comes flush to the very end. So that means that um, we had considered this in a previous video when we looked at the assembly line render and you saw this thing with the deck all the way to the end. And indeed, that is Delta. Delta does have the hood going all the way to the end, which I think has many advantages. The number one being uh, that when you lift up the hood and you try to load something in the back, if you rest it on here, you're not going to scratch the um, that little part in the back of the... Uh, so the previous one, let's see if I can go back. See right here, if you tried to load into here, you would scuff this up pretty bad. But if you go in here, there's this part you're scuffing is the carpet underneath there or whatever's on the interior trim. Okay, so that's number one. Uh, number two thing that we noticed is that this grill pattern is different. So I'll show you. Um, this is a picture I took of the Gamma at fully charged. And you can see here the grill pattern ends right here. So it's just like not even the same size as, it's probably like two thirds the size of this um, license plate cover and it ends. So it's this thing, but if you look at the new uh, Gamma, this thing extends very far. I suspect it extends all the way to where the lights are. That's just my guess. We don't. We haven't seen it. Uh, and then another thing I realized is that the picture that they put out yesterday when they were talking about using the Tesla plug, um, which is this one, you notice that this is actually also Delta. So you can see here, I didn't notice this because I thought this was just white, but if you look carefully here, there are uh, solar cells up in here and this grill pattern is different. Now here's the difference between this one and the one that they released today. Um, if you look here, this is this is square. This is square. Um, it doesn't cant in at an angle. If you look at this one, it's deeper here and shallower here, so it cants in at an angle. Now, when I saw the Tesla plug at at uh, fully charged here, if you open this, and I don't have a video of it open, but the Tesla plug does cant. And you can see it clearly here. This is uh, one of their B-reels from Aptera. They haven't installed the Tesla plug in here yet, but you can see that it cants. And here they haven't installed any of the um, cameras, whereas at fully charged, they had installed the cameras here. Um, but you can see that it cants like this. Now, in the, uh, the picture from yesterday, this still cants. And in the picture they released today, it does not can't. It is flush. So it goes, the plug goes straight in. And the other thing you realize is uh, some of the fixtures are different. Like this one doesn't have um, an extra bolt here, but the new one has extra bolts here and here. I don't know. I suspect this is the newer iteration. This was probably the previous uh, the, uh, Delta. And this is the final iteration of Delta here. You can see here, this kind of looks like forged uh, uh, forged carbon maybe. I don't know, it looks, uh, it looks like some kind of fibrous pattern. And you can see the uh, camera here. What look, is a little confusing to me is usually, if you look here, this part is very narrow. It comes to a point. And this one makes it look like it's wide here. I think that's just the way the lighting is or something. But just the way that this looks, it looks like it's wide here. So I don't know if they've changed the design of this rear wheel cover or not. But it does look like it's a, it looks a little different than, than this. Yeah, see, this, this looks narrow. And here, so you see this looks narrow. It comes to a point. But this looks wider. Anyway, I really like the new grill design. Now, the other thing I was trying to figure out is, is this a computer render or an actual picture 
because if it's an actual picture, that means they're building a physical delta. And I was really hoping that I'd be surprised and figure out that they have an actual delta. But mm, I think it's a render. I think it's a render. I mean, renders are so good these days that it's hard to tell what's a render and what's a real picture. You know, obviously these, uh, these are um, Allen, like they use Allen wrench uh, screws rather than the uh, really Phillips head screws, which I think look much nicer. So I, you know, I definitely prefer those. But I think it's a render. I don't think it's um, a physical delta. I'd be very, very surprised if they had a physical delta. But anyway, very exciting. I, I suspect what this means is uh, last time with, with Gamma, they teased out little parts, you know, every couple of days or every week. And I think that's what they're going to do. They're going to tease us with little parts of delta for the rest of the year. And at the end of the year, they're going to release the entire delta design. Um, I suspect that's what's going to happen. They've promised a Delta design by the end of the year. I suspect that they will reach that deadline. You know, previously we'd hoped there might be a physical Delta, but I, I don't think that that's happening. Um, but yeah, I really like the, the hood going all the way to the end. It allows for more solar cells, which is good. And it allows for a hatch that uh, goes all the way to the end. So when you load things from the back, you won't scratch up the surface of the back. All right, well, tell me what you guys think. Is this a render or an actual picture? Is this thing actually wider? Did they change the design of the rear wheel cover? And um, I'm pretty sure this is sitting flush. Do you think it's sitting flush? The gamma definitely was canted in one direction. And I really didn't like the canted in design. I think flush is better. And then the uh, hood to the back, I think, is confirmed at this point. And I believe it's a better design. Tell me what you guys think. Thanks for watching. Thanks, as always, to our um, supporting members. And have a great day, everyone.